sweating getting ready. That's kind of disgusting. I ended up doing my hair really quickly because I just felt like it was just so unruly. I don't want to go to school like that. So I have class from 9 a.m. till 12, which is so fun. It's statistics, which my class is all the way downtown. And I'm in Queens, which is all the way uptown. But it should only take, I just take one train to get there and then walk, it's super easy. I'm not looking forward to being in a classroom for four hours, especially because I haven't done it in so long. I think the last time I was in a classroom, like in a physical classroom, actually maybe it wasn't that long ago, like two years ago, 2022, fall of 2022, I think is when I took my last in-person classes, but we're doing it. Made a coffee. They usually give you like a break, like a 15 minute break somewhere in between. Depending on how well this wakes me up, I might have to get another coffee. So, we'll see. I'm gonna bring some plantain chips and maybe I won't do a coffee. Here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna do plantain chips. I don't function well before 9 a.m. I really don't. We're gonna do plantain chips. We're gonna do a couple espresso beans. These are chocolate covered espresso beans. I just get like a pack from Trader Joe's. I think it's like a dollar, two dollars or something. And I keep them in the fridge. And I just usually take like two or three. When I need a little, a little pick me up, but I'll bring a couple so that I can stay focused in class. Oh, fuck, in high school I was so bad. I used to fall asleep in class in high school, in senior year. Senior year only, because I was just so tired all the time. I was working three jobs. I feel like I might need a beverage. Because it's pool. I'll bring a little San Pellegrino. Why not? Literally, I just don't want it to get my other stuff wet. Alexa, is it going to rain today? I'm gonna bring a book to read on the train. Oh, I'm gonna bring my book up. Look, I need to get this done by next week. So, we are reading The Women by Kristen Hanna for book club. And book club meets next week, and I've only read, I think, like three chapters. Amazing. All right, let's rock and roll. Fit check, this top is from American Eagle. These jeans are from Zara, and then shoes are Pumas. Because they're really, really comfortable. Okay, now we gotta go. We are back home and I am immediately in house clothes because the fact that my clothes touch like the subway and the outside you could not get me to sit on my couch in outside clothes anyways class was good the professor is not organized so i imagine i'm going to do a lot of independent learning for this class which kind of sucks because i'm not the best independent learner like i need you to teach me the information and then I practice, but it is what it is. So right now I'm going to make a ham and cheese sandwich because I'm hungry, but I don't want to eat anything like crazy filling. I have the party later. I move you guys. My friend Danielle is a doctor. She got her doctor of nursing practice and we're having a really big party to celebrate her tonight, so I'm very excited. But because of that, I don't wanna eat anything really heavy because she has a full like catering menu thing and I wanna eat there because she already paid for it. <laughs> I ended up realizing that bringing a crispy snack was probably not the best idea because it would make noise while he's teaching. And then I also had to pee the whole time so I didn't drink this. This is going right back in the fridge.
Achiever. I love it. Danny was always competitive academically, never gave back below a B. Labor Day. I went to Target. Let's do a little haul. Tissues for the bathroom. Scotch Bright refills. Chick fil A Polynesian sauce. Because it's just so good, so I wanted that. <laughs> Caramel Macchiato espresso drink. It's my favorite one for iced coffee. And then toilet paper. Charmin Ultra Soft. The party was so much fun. I don't know, I don't think I got that many clips because I was just having fun on the dance floor, not giving a fuck. Truly, I think the best party I've ever been to in my life. It was so much fun, so well thought out, all around. I loved celebrating my friend Danielle. And it was just such a good time. Good vibes, everybody there was just, like made you feel so comfortable to have fun and to be, you know, ourselves. I had such a great time. Love the girls that I was with, love the vibes in the room, all of her friends and family. They are such, you can just tell how beautiful a person Danielle is inside and out by her friends and the people that she keeps in her company. So good, so much fun. That DJ was incredible. 10 out of 10. I don't think I've ever had a better DJ at any event ever. He was playing the throwbacks, the hits. He was playing like, he played bachata. He played, I think it's called Saka. Saka. I don't know. Don't quote me on that. Um, it was so good. It was so fun. He played the like trending songs now, the throwback songs. It was so good. He took requests really well. I requested Corazón Sin Cara by Prince Royce because it's just such a good song. I also requested Dancing Queen because I was waiting for it to come up and it didn't. So I requested it and that was a hit. That was a hit. Everybody was on the dance floor and I will take credit for that. I had a wax appointment this morning. I slept in since it's Labor Day. And now I'm just gonna sort of tidy up. I want to make some progress in my closet today doing some like organization. It doesn't need to be fully done, but I would like to make some headway. You know what I'm actually gonna do right now because I really don't feel like doing that right this second. I'm gonna have my coffee. I'm gonna read my book club book because it's a really good book and I kind of, I wanna know what happens next. And then, then I'll start organizing stuff.
chilly now. Yeah. <laughs>